Hi, my name is Dave Gross, and I'm speaking to you from my garage. It's Thursday, March 19th, and like many of you, my kids are out of school, and my wife and I are working from home, which for us means moving to remote teaching. This is the beginning of a pandemic that's gonna have grave health outcomes. And so like my teaching, we've moved our campaign to completely digital, which is why I'm speaking to you on video as opposed to in person. I moved to Colorado 25 years ago to get my PhD in financial economics. I fell in love with teaching, I fell in love with Colorado, and I fell in love with my fellow grad student who's now my wife. And all these years later, we both teach at CU and have two great thriving kids. So after almost 25 years in the classroom, I've taught thousands and thousands of students. I've also done lots of administration and service at CU. I've led college and campus diversity curriculum and budget committees, and I'm the associate chair of the finance department responsible for the teaching mission at Leeds. And I'm a committed public servant with a long history of community not-for-profit work. I just finished my terms as first treasurer and then president of the Dairy Arts Center. And before that, I was treasurer of Boulder Valley Women's Health Center. I'm an expert in public finance. In fact, that's my title, outside expert on the Boulder City Council Audit Committee. As a financial expert with 25 years as an educator and an established commitment to public service, I'm running for CU Region to put progressive values with education and financial expertise on the board. This pandemic will have a dramatic impact on our economy. And as a result, CU's state education funding and federal research funding is in peril. We must protect access to higher education for working class Coloradans and ensure all CU employees have safe, stable jobs. The primary responsibility of the Regents is oversight of the nearly $5 billion a year annual budget. Now more than ever, we need CU Regents to protect what needs to be protected.